Back to Wednesday morning on ITV1 and stand back. The world's deadliest dancers take center stage on you being framed in half an hour. First, though, big money to be won on Cat's Phrase. And as lively as ever, here's Nick Weir. ITV Christmas Entertainment, sponsored by Rennie Soft Shoes. Christmas never tasted so good. The show that's fun for all the family. And here's a man who's good to his family. He seldom goes home. Yes, it's Nick Weir. Hey, it's me, 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 me. <laughs> Hello, welcome to Catchphrase. Buonasera, benvenuti, buenas noches, bienvenido, bonsoir, bienvenue, guten Abend und herzlich willkommen. Hey. We can still do this show using the dreaded Euro, but for now, it's still pound sterling, and let's start giving some away! <laughs> right, let's meet tonight's two contestants, who are Caroline and Chris! <laughs> Caroline, welcome to the show. Tell me Hi. about yourself before we get going. I'm Caroline. I'm from Saddleworth. I'm married to Adam. I've got two children, Sophie and Jabus, and I'm a florist. Okay, great. Welcome to the show, Chris. Hi. Hi. Tell me about yourself. Hi, I'm Chris. I'm originally from Belfast. I live in London. I have two children, Kyle Norsler, and I run a pub in Covent Garden. Okay, let me ask you both a question. Very important. I ask it every week. You can go anywhere in the world, okay? No limits to your selection, anywhere. The most exciting holiday, the most romantic holiday, whatever. Where would you pick as your dream destination, Caroline? Lapland. Lapland? <laughs> in, in Finland, is it? Yeah, that's right. Um, any reasons? Um, well, me and my husband would really like to go on ski doos and we'd really like to take the children to see Father Christmas. Oh. oh. Okay, Chris? I'd love to go to Hawaii, Nick. Okay, Hawaii? It's, I mean, it, Any reasons? It's a really beautiful place to go to, but more importantly, I've got friends live there who I haven't seen for a long time. This would be a great way to do it. All right. As you know, somebody will get to the super catchphrase. Could be either one of you. If you win the super catchphrase, if you navigate across the screen correctly, you will be making your dreams come true. We will put together the most unforgettable holiday you can possibly imagine. However, you need spending money when you get there. And let's start making some right now. Are you ready to play? Yep. Ready to play. Let's play catchphrase. <laughs> Round one. A quick reminder, the catchphrases at this part of the show are worth £100 each. We've also got some instant prizes that go along with some of the catchphrases. I'll tell you about that as we go. And also, a little reminder, as always, the beginning part of the show, you uh, only get one try at the catchphrases. And the reason I warn you is if you guess and you guess wrong, you might trigger something off in your opponent's mind and they get your money. OK, so be careful. Right, focus, fingers ready, let's have some fun, let's have a catchphrase. <laughs> Caroline. Find us keepers. That's the one. Well done. You're off the mark. <laughs> Caroline, you're very relieved just to get the first one done, aren't you? I am. <laughs> yeah, you look so Can different. Can I go home now? <laughs> <laughs> OK, no, there's loads more money to make. Let's start doing it. £200 in the bonus bank. Behind those shapes, a catchphrase. Get one out of the way. Have a game. Um, reading books. No. Chris, you're back in. Here's a catchphrase. Caroline. The face that lost, uh, launched a thousand ships. Well done. Another hundred pounds. <laughs> the smile is getting bigger and bigger. <laughs> All right. One night, we took ten pounds out because the guest wrong. He's in front. Go for it. Um. Okay. But, but, uh, no. That's no. all right. You're not obliged to try. Chris. 
You hear that sound? That means there's an instant prize. It has a CD player, cassette deck, and FM AM tuner. It's an auto power save function micro system. <laughs> now, if you get the next catchphrase right, you get £100 plus that prize, OK? So there's a lot on this. Here it is. Chinese restaurant. Chris. Chinese crackers. No. Caroline, you want to take it? Fortune cookie. Well done. Another hundred pounds. <laughs> hey. You've got a hundred pounds, Caroline, and you've got a brand new multifunction microsystem. Not bad. Oh, thank you. <laughs> do you know what that is? No. No, do I? <laughs> but okay. it sounds good. <laughs> yeah, it sounds great. 180 pounds. Bonus bank. Take a shape. <laughs> Um, Moroccan news? <laughs> no, not the one, Chris. You're back in. Here's a catchphrase. Chris. Daisy chain. No. Caroline. Daisy wheel. Well done. Daisy wheel. <laughs> and typewriters, right? And typewriters. All right, don't lose heart, Chris. Plenty of time. Anyway, there's 170 pounds in the bonus bank now, Caroline. Try and get it. Uh, three wise men. Well done! <laughs> Storming. OK, let's look at the winnings. Chris, you have yet to start, but nothing to worry about. Plenty more money available. Caroline, you're in front with 570 pounds. Come on, Chris. Hawaii, you know, it's still a long way away, and right now you've got a nice round uh, figure. Nothing. Okay, <laughs> it's time for round two. Remember, the catchphrases now are worth £150. Okay, more instant prizes available, and which help things along a little bit. There's a theme, and it's romance. Okay, things to do with romance. Ready? Here's your first romantic catchphrase. Chris. Love makes the world go round. You're off the mark. It's still applauding. <laughs> All right, Chris. That should do you some good. £250 in the bonus bank. We've increased it by £50. We've changed the shapes to balloons. Other than that, everything's the same. Go for it. The road to nowhere. OK, it's a good catchphrase, but isn't the one we're looking for at the moment. You hear that? That means there's another instant prize available. And it's four first-class return tickets on Eurostar from London to a town just full of old-world charm. One of you will be going to Lille. <laughs> first class. <laughs> what was that, Chris? We'll do it together. <laughs> oh, yeah, go together. OK. All right, here we go, then. You've got to win a catchphrase, and here it is, and it's romantic. Yes, Caroline. Getting hitched. Well done. Getting hitched is right. <laughs> Caroline, you've got more money. You've got a CD player and a microsystem. You just won four first-class tickets to Lille. <laughs> hey? <laughs> you were so nervous before. OK, £240 now. Goose on the road? No, but you are along the right lines. Remember that. Chris, you're back in. Here's a romantic catchphrase. Oh, Caroline. Money can't buy love. No, not the one. Chris, you want to steal? Love for money. The catchphrase is not for love nor money. Oh. We're being a bit hard there, but it is actually... That's the catchphrase. OK, it's in the uh, catchphrase book. <laughs> OK. <laughs> called ad-libbing badly. OK, here we go. Chris, you're in. Caroline, you're in. Here's a catchphrase. Caroline. Broken Heart Hotel. Oh, no, Chris. Heartbreak steal. Hotel. Heartbreak Hotel's right. <laughs> and I know why you know that. Because Chris <laughs> is a big Elvis fan, right? I am, yes. <laughs> OK, good luck. 2.30 in the bonus bank. Take a shake. Wild Goose Chip. Sorry? Wild Goose Chip. Yes, well done! <laughs> nice recovery, Chris. 
We're still in second place. You've got 530 pounds. Caroline's in the lead with 720. <laughs> Good. Chris is going to make a game of it. Right, it's the half-time whistle coming up soon. So join us in the second half when we'll be finding out whether Caroline or Chris will be playing in the super catchphrase for their holiday of a lifetime. Don't go away. ITV Christmas Entertainment, sponsored by Rennie Soft Shoes. It's a... Christmas never tasted so good. Welcome back. Now, I've got to tell you, I'm really flattered. Caroline, as you know, is a florist, and she's actually brought in some flowers for me. Thanks very much. Quite jungly, that one. It's lovely. Yeah, a little like myself. <laughs> hey, 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 Caroline. <laughs> See you in the bar later. <laughs> OK, thanks, Caroline. Just quick recap of the scores. Before the break, Chris was on £530. Caroline was in the lead with 720 They're both truly in it. Anyone can win it. And it's time for a cash countdown. <laughs> Right, we just had the flowers put in the dressing room so that Caroline doesn't spill water all over the place. Just a quick reminder of the rules in the cash countdown. You could win as much as £500. You've got to be quick because you're up against the clock. Actually, the quicker you are, the richer you are. Chris, you're trailing a bit, but it's anybody's game. You ready for the first one? Ready. Time for a cash countdown. Chris. Nelson's column. No, not quite. Chris. Nelson's pillar. No, not the one. Keep trying. Now what is it, Caroline? Half a Nelson's column. No, you can make a catchphrase, Chris. Half Nelson. Yes, oh. half Nelson. Thanks, <laughs> Hey, Chris, you've finally done to Caroline what she's been doing to you all night. <laughs> stealing her money. OK, £300 in the bonus bank. Some squiggly shapes. Go for it. Castle turn. No, not the one. Caroline, you're back in. Get your lead back. Here's a cash countdown. Caroline. Men in white coats. Yes, men in white coats. Yeah. Well done. 427 pounds. You're back in the lead. OK. Lapland now leads Hawaii. 290 pounds in the bonus bank. Take a shape. Football night. Not even close. Chris, you're back in. Here's a cash countdown. Chris. General dog. Oh, so close. Make a catchphrase. Chris. Old soldier dog. No, you were much closer before. Caroline. Old dog general. No. Oh, no. Almost. Caroline. Old... Spaniel General. <laughs> <laughs> no, forget about the species, all right? The, forget about the breed, it's just the animal. You got it right. Chris? General Dog. Bit more. Caroline? General Doggy. No, when you're, when you're, when you're redundant and you're not needed. General Dog's body, yeah. General Dog's body! <laughs> 47 <laughs> quid. <laughs> OK. Here we go. This will put you in the lead. 280. Take a squiggle. Shanny Brett Castle. <laughs> no. <laughs> OK. Caroline, you're back in. You're still in the lead. Here's a cash countdown. Red Chris. letter day. No. Keep trying. Caroline. First class post. Yeah. Yes, well done. 47 again. Interesting. Okay, Caroline, the bonus bank, 270 now. Take a shape. Um Ball and Castle? No, Chris, you're back in. Here's a cash countdown. Chris. Throat doctor. No. Caroline. Put your money where your mouth is. No, there's a bit more to come. Watch for it. Chris? Put your money in your mouth. <laughs> no. <laughs> Caroline? Money talks. No. Look at that bit. Wait, it's coming. 
Chris. Monty Williams pasture <laughs> mutt. That's a catchphrase you might use in your pub, but not in catchphrase. Keep trying. Caroline. Waving your money about. No. Chris. Choke on your own money. <laughs> no. <laughs> Choke on your own money. It was, a, it was it used in a film. Oh, it was. Show me the money! Nothing to worry about. We've got plenty more. You ready? Here's a cash countdown. Caroline. Uh, chief cook and bottle washer. Well done! <laughs> yeah! That's good, eh, Chris? Try and take it away from her. Okay, 260 in a bonus bank. Take a shape. Um, oh, um, rough uh, Coleman. <laughs> I'll put you out of your misery. Yeah. No. <laughs> Chris, you're back in. Here's a cash countdown. Chris. Stuff shirt. Stuff shirt's right. What well up? 437. Making a recovery. Okay, let's get a bonus bank. 250. Taking calls from Newcastle. Yeah! Well done. Chris, good recovery. Still behind. You've got 1,624. In front is Caroline with 1,986. Okay. This is okay. Time for more cash countdowns. Ready? Here's another one. Chris. Out of the frown pan into the fire. No, it's a good one. Not the one we're looking for, though. Chris. Fly stunts. No. Caroline. Flash in the pan. That's the one. 412. <laughs> Keeping the lead. You've broken the £2,000 mark. 350 in the bonus bank now. Take a shake. Me after a night out. <laughs> <laughs> OK, no, it's not the one. Chris, you're in. Cash countdown. Caroline. Window parking. No. You're along the right lines, though. What do you call that area? Chris? Parking meter. No. Keep trying. Caroline? Window zone. No. Parking Chris? zone. Sorry? Parking zone. No. Think about another way to describe that zone. Officially, they're called bays. It's a bay oh, window. Yeah. window. <laughs> Getting clever. Okay. A cosmic blowout. We've run out of time. No more cash countdowns, but we've still got £340 in the bonus bank. OK, it's going to go to one of you. We'll take away the remaining shapes. First in gets the cash. Here it is. Caroline. Judge and draw jury. No. So Chris. Good the judge. Sorry, no. Keep trying. Ooh. Um. It's all there now. Time oh, up. It was, it's quite a clever one. It was rough justice. Oh. Um, rough justice. Nothing to worry about because we've got £340. We're going to give it to you. We'll show you a catchphrase. First to get it gets the money. Here it is. <laughs> Caroline. Battered cod. Yes! <laughs> OK. Chris, Hawaii is not going to be a possibility. However, you have got £1,624, but our winner is Caroline with £2,738. <laughs> OK, Chris, let me ask you. Oh, I'll tell you what. Hey, Chris, did you have a good time? I'm planning to. <laughs> hey, we could change it to match phrase. <laughs> All right, Chris, you've got £1,624. You were great fun. Let's give him a big cheer. Thanks, Chris. <laughs> For Caroline, with £2,738, you're going to play the super catchphrase. Let's do it. Come on. We're here at the Super Catch Phrase. You're looking confident. You're feeling confident? 
OK, have a look at the screen. The flag of Finland, OK, Lapland in Finland. That's where you want to go for your dream holiday. We're going to put it all together. All you've got to do is get across the screen. Let's have a look at the grid. There it is, A to Y, behind each letter, a catchphrase. And all you've got to do is get across the screen, left to right, by correctly answering the catchphrases. OK, remember, only adjacent moves. This is what I want you to try and do. All right, and you're on good form, so there's no reason why you won't. If you're not sure of one, don't waste too much time. Pass will block you. No diagonals. You can, you can do something like this. Over the top. All right, and there's time to pass two, three times as well and still get the holiday okay. if you're nice and calm. Okay, if you get across the screen in 60 seconds or less, we are going to send you to Lapland. Excellent. For the best vacation of your life. Well, okay. I hope so, yeah. All right, <laughs> let me just find out if my friends think you're going to do it. I don't know. I'm just going to ask them. Is she going to go to Lapland? Yeah! Oh, no gaps. All right, a lot of positive energy. Okay. Take your seat. I'm right behind you. Right. Caroline, when you're ready, give me your first letter. Right. K. K. Um, uh, eyes in the back of your head. Right, another letter. L. L. Um, uh, opening a can of worms. All right, another letter. M. M. Um, ha car, house, house, car, Make, house yeah. of cards. That's it. Another letter. Uh, N. N. Um, pulling, pulling your hair out. Yes, that's the one. Another letter. Uh, uh, um, O. O. Duck, ducks. Not ducks. Ducks on your arm. Not ducks. Um, swans. No. Uh, goose, go, goose, yes. goose bumps. Yeah! <laughs> You've done it, babe. <laughs> right, let's bring your husband down. Come on, Adam. Come down here. Give your wife a well deserved kiss and hug. <laughs> hey, break it up. Family show. All right. Well done, eh? Really? Yeah. Good, didn't you? Yeah. All right. Hey, this is the good news. First of all, the first bit of good news: the tickets are ready. And there they are. <laughs> right. Not only that, but your total winnings nine thousand and ninety-eight pounds <laughs> in twenty-five minutes. <laughs> hey, there's plenty of ice in Lapland, and there's also plenty of ice in the bar. Thank You're buying. Me, yeah. All right. <laughs> hey, we'll see you next week for loads more catchphrases. We're going to have a drink. See ya. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Harry Hill is here next for You've Been Framed. That's followed by Wednesday's latest news at 20 to 1 and then the first of the Star Wars trilogy. Prepare to feel the force with Harrison Ford, Mark Hamill and Carrie Fisher this afternoon at 12.50. Christmas Entertainment.